This part of the presentation demonstrates how to select pieces from gross specimens that will eventually end up in a paraffin wax block. The choice of these pieces depends very much on the type of finished section you would wish to see. Once selected, the material has to be preserved by fixation, and we will deal with the choice of fixative later. Here we have a variety of botanical specimens and some previously fixed animal tissues. Select pieces with a sharp knife or a safety razor blade, which is particularly ideal for this purpose. Think ahead to how the material will look in a wax block and how you can select pieces from the specimen that will represent the structures you want to see in your stained sections. In the main with botany, you are choosing stems, leaves, roots, fruits or flowers. Do not make the pieces too thick as they have to be penetrated by the fluids we will use. And remember, the larger the specimen, the more difficult the sectioning will be. The ribbon of sections will have a shiny and a dull side as seen here and it is important for the floating out step that the ribbons are placed on the water surface shiny side down. The floating out bath should be at least 50 degrees centigrade just below the melting point of the wax. This will flatten out and stretch the sections prior to mounting them on a slide. The ribbons can be cut with a safety blade into manageable lengths of about six sections or so. A bowl of warm tap water makes a perfectly good floating out bath, providing it has a good surface area and enough depth for a microscope slide to be held vertically. Using a pair of curve ended forceps that must be kept clean at all times, select a short ribbon of sections by one end. Sweep them across the surface of the water bath so that the free end catches the water and then effectively lay the ribbon on the water using the side of the bath to disconnect the ribbon from the forceps if necessary. 